The colonization of the moon and Mars, depicted in the film, represents a long-term goal for humanity. While the moon has already been visited by astronauts, establishing permanent bases and exploiting its resources will require significant investments and technological advancements. Mars, with its thin atmosphere and inhospitable surface, poses even greater challenges for colonization. However, the presence of frozen water on Mars and the possibility of producing oxygen from its atmosphere make this planet an attractive target for future exploration and colonization. The film also touches on the possible existence of extraterrestrial life, which is driven by the Lima Project. Although the search for extraterrestrial life remains one of the greatest unknowns in science, projects such as SETI, Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence, continue to search for radio signals from alien civilizations. Finally, the loneliness and isolation experienced by astronauts on long-duration missions are real psychological issues that must be addressed. Confinement in close quarters, separation from family and friends, and exposure to hostile environments can all take their toll on astronauts' mental health. In Ad Astra, Roy McBride battles his own inner demons and emotional disconnection, mirroring the psychological challenges astronauts face in real life. Careful astronaut selection, psychological training, and ongoing support are essential to ensuring the mental well-being of space explorers. In short, Ad Astra combines science fiction elements with real scientific concepts, inviting reflection on the challenges and possibilities of space exploration, the search for extraterrestrial life, and humanity's future in the cosmos. The film also raises questions about human nature, ambition, loneliness, and the search for meaning in a vast, unexplored universe.